We're at Gamescom 2016 and we're catching up with Logitech to see what kind of new products you got coming. You got something that's out now that's that's available. Let's let's start there. Uh, what can you tell us of this mouse? So uh, we actually announced this uh, mouse at Gamescom. This is the Logitech G Pro mou uh, gaming mouse. This is uh, one of many uh, uh, products we have created together with our eSport team. So it's. Uh, especially for these guys, uh, everybody can of course use this. But it's it's a nice, sleek design with the best technology that we have uh, built inside of it. So you have the PMW3366 optical sensor, the most advanced uh, sensor in the world. Uh, you can calibrate it to any surface you want. Uh, it has high movement or can handle high movement, so it's no delay or anything when you use this for for your game. It has a, a very nice spring system um, uh, that gives a very, very good click feel when you're playing with it. Um, and it has a two meter long braided cable. It's perfect for the, the pro players. You will see uh, our team Cloud9 and Team Solomid use this during competition going going forward. This is very much like a, like a, a rally car or something where you put out all the padding, all the radio, everything like that just to make it as light and as fast and as sort of sleek as possible. Exactly. So, you know, uh, the weight is very, very important for the pro gamers. They, they really, really challenged us and the engineers teams uh, due to that. So we were able to get this down to 83 grams. So, you know, the, the good thing with working with these two games is, uh, teams sorry, is that they... They are very, very into uh, into um, uh, well. It's it's very important for them when it comes to to the technology. I mean, one milli millisecond is is the difference between winning and losing. Uh, so I mean, and we have full access to them. They're, they're actually playing or training at our office in California. Very cool. The other products all here belong to one a new product line that you're you're announcing. Uh, what can you tell us of the motivation behind this product line? Because it's something a little bit different. Because a lot of gaming, uh, gaming gear is sort of catered to be as advanced as possible. This is sort of targeting another group of, of gamers, but while still sort of keeping the benefits of everything that you've sort of developed. Yeah, I mean, we, we aren't just a company that creates peripherals for pro gamers. I mean, there is tons of regular gamers out there or casual gamers. I mean... Uh, I have uh, I have a family. I have a daughter. Uh, I prioritize family. I prioritize work. And I mean, in the end of the day, uh, I try. I struggle to find time to to really to really game and and enjoy my game. So I mean, I th I think this is kind of the product lineup for for these guys. Uh, they don't, don't don't really need 83 grams of weight. And they just need um, products, gaming peripherals that will give them the best ever ex uh, best possible experience for when they find time to do their play. It's interesting. What can you tell us of the keyboard if we start over there? So this is the next generation of Robber Dome. Um, it's, it's actually uh, standardized uh, keys that gives the same feel as mechanical uh, switches. Uh, and they are also four times faster than, than regular standardized uh, keys. Uh, it has RGB. Uh, so, I mean, you can can highlight the, your movement buttons in some colors or you know the, the shooting uh, buttons in, in other colors and so on. You have the F keys that is programmable. Uh, it's, it's really, really a nice keyboard to use when you're, you're gaming. If we look at the, mo the, the mice as well, uh, one, one uh, wired, one wireless, uh, they, kind of, they kind of seem to have some things in common with the pro gaming mouse. Even though they're they're higher, they're a little bit heavier, uh, but they, they also don't have the multitude of buttons. Uh, what can you tell us of this, and, and more specifically about the insides? So uh, we um, we are we so we do have the the pro teams that are sitting together with us in California in our office, uh, but I mean we we are a company that build equipment for all gamers. So we, we did uh, some studies where we uh, talked about uh, talked with casual gamers what kind of shape and feeling they preferred. And it was quite different 
from the uh, pro players. Uh, weight wasn't necessarily the most important part, but still they wanted great technology inside in terms of the sensor and also, of course, the click feel. Uh, so, I mean, the, the sensor and the switch is exactly the same as the pro mice. It's a little bit heavier, not much, uh, but it's, it's really the shape here that is very, very comfortable when you are playing for, for hours and hours. But I... Uh, but yeah, and when you look at the technology, uh, you know, it's one that's corded, it's one that's cordless. So in the, uh, the wireless one, we're actually using the same wireless technology that we're using uh, on the G900. Uh, so this is a mice that you can, you know, go to a LAN party, sit uh, together with uh, other people with tons of wireless equipment and Bluetooth and wireless around the, the room. Uh, and still it will have a faster report rate to the computer than... Uh, than uh, you know, some of our competitors' corded mice. So I mean, it's really the first-class uh, technology built in here. Um, it's a little bit heavier than the uh, the one that is corded. We are just talking about 15 grams, uh, and the reason for that is the um, uh, is the battery inside there. It's a it's still a small light battery, and it gives you 30 hours plus uh, gaming. If you want it heavier, and this is for both of them, you can actually put in weights. So in the package there's a 10 gram weight that you can put here uh, to get it heavier if you want to do that. Cool. And we have the final product, it's the headset. It's also part of the same Prodigy line. Uh, what what uh, can you tell us of this? Yeah, so what we learned is that uh, you know the, the casual gamer doesn't necessarily only game on, uh, on PC. They also have consoles in terms of PlayStation 4 or Xbox. So we wanted to really make sure that we met their dem demand as well. So it's it's a um, um, high quality stereo sound. So it's a great drivers built in here. You can it's very comfortable to wear them, so you can play for hours. You can even take these off and wash them, um, and then put them on again um, uh, if you use them often. Um, so it's, uh, and also, I mean, it's a noise cancelling microphone. Uh, it's flexible, you can get it closer to the mouth if you want to. And you can also put it away if you want to go on mute or not use it, uh, use it at all. Here is the connection, so it's, uh, it's uh, perfect to just plug it into the uh, Xbox or PlayStation 4 controller. Or if you want to go PC, uh, for PC gaming you have both the microphone and the the sound uh, pin as well that you can just connect on on here. So it's a it's a very nice, uh, comfortable headset uh, that that gives you the best sound uh, experience in stereo. When are you bringing uh, uh, this one is out? Of course, the pro gaming mouse. When do you plan to bring out the the Prodigy products? So uh, this one, as you said, is already out. Uh, this lineup, the Prodigy lineup, we will. Uh, you will find in stores in September. So the announcement date on these are the 2nd of September. All right. cool. cool. Thank you very much for your time. Thank you for visiting us here.